So I know somewhere in the world it's been day. I'll be married a year. Third time lucky. We're, 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 we're all in the, the same club. Be yeah. well, really careful on these mowers because you go over like that. There you go. Is that your ring? Oh, they're really good. They're seriously good. And the fish. Batter. Hey, well, that was a very unusual. Um, now some very unusual visitors. That little blackbird is still up in the tree. <laughs> It's warm, but the sunshine has gone. And apparently it's going to be overcast for a while. I need a big bin jump. Um, and I was just looking back a year ago today is when we spotted the blackbird chicks up here. Um, so anybody that was watching the vlogs from last year, it was, uh, yeah, it was a year ago that they hatched. And a few people said they spotted a bird in here, but no chicks that I know of. Keep, I keep looking up, hoping. Um, bit of a strange day coming up. Um, I've done pretty well all the mowing. I might just flip down to the ten pitches at the bottom and give them a quick go over on the Stega. And who's missing? What's missing? No rasher. So Rasha is now back down at the bungalow with um, Sandra. So uh, obviously Sandra is going to be going back home. I think she mentioned in the last video. And then she's going to the Treehouse Festival um, for a week. So obviously when that happens, Rasha will be back with me. But Rasha has now started her new Lincolnshire life as well. Uh, so today as well, we might have a tidy up. This was all ended up all temporary. This corner here, um, possibly just needs to be gone through and have a look at and have a bit of a sort out, possibly. Yeah, I think it's going to be a slowish day. So we've got, so people have left this morning, including Mr. and Mrs. Evans, um, who are looking for land stroke property. Another one going off. And then obviously this afternoon's arrivals on, uh, and then once everybody's on this afternoon, I'm back to um, I'm back to the bungalow for my two days off. A lot to start on. I can still hear the blackbird. Can you hear? You okay? <sighs> right, that's toilets and showers all done, and um, I bet nobody. Nobody will be able to guess what I'm going to have for my dinner later. I bet none of you can guess. If you do do, you get Blue Peter badge. <laughs> but you'll need to apply to Blue Peter. I'm just going to go and get my dinner out of the car. It's way too early for dinner, but soon. Strange being back in the caravan. All quiet. No Russia. She's normally sat on the bed, isn't she? Um, so she's at the van. Uh, so I just had a message from Sandra. The electrician is in now finishing off his bits and bobs. So all being well by the time I get there later on this afternoon, early evening, all the electric finishes off as should be done. And uh, yeah, and it's Sandra's very, very first sort of day on her own. <laughs> Not having to worry about going back to work or packing her bags or living out of, well, she can start unpacking her suitcases. Um, so yeah, just, just need to make sure everything's okay. And it's still a bit early for dinner. But what, what will I be having? It's very still and it's very warm and it's very cloudy. So I know somewhere in the world it's been day. Ah, oh, been days not for another couple of days, but that's our bin. Oh. Should last until bin emptying day. I need some chalk. I need some. I need to. I need to. Don't tell Dave or Tracy. 
But at some stage, I need to find some of their chalk and change that. What have they got? Baps. Not cobs or rolls. Baps. I need to rub that out and put balms. Come on, Mancunians, people in the northwest, you know what a balm cake is. We need that changing, don't we? Right, dinner time. Uh, pitch number 19 and 20. Although you're on 20, but you've also got 19. Welcome to the nurseries. Uh, dinner, 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 dinner. I don't think, since being a campsite warden, I've ever had a, this for my dinner. Anyway, look at that there. I've got some leftover mixed special chow mein that we had for our tea tonight. So I'm going to, oops. I'm going to scoff that down with a bottle of water. I just had the initial um, arrivals are in now, and then I've got some more coming in. I've got a couple of sailors doing at four, uh, and I'm going to have a little bit of a window, I think, where I need to go on the Husqvarna down by one of the new lodges and finish off some work that I started a couple of days ago. Come, come close. Oh, 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 Right, now listen, I've given some confessions here to you, but you must not ever let Sandra know. Right. All right? Yeah. Whatever you do, don't let Sandra know. I'll not say a word to Sandra. No. Not till I see her. You mustn't do. Right, you're on your, um, it's the second night with us. When did you come? We come yesterday. 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 Second night, yeah. Yeah, you know the nice little stay? Yeah, it's beautiful. It's a beautiful site, quiet, clean. Everybody's friendly. Definitely recommend the calf for a breakfast. I was say, what was the breakfast like? Yeah, beautiful. <laughs> Stephen Tracy. Um, yeah, a lovely so couple. Call him Stephen Tracy. Dave and Dave, Tracy. Yeah, the beautiful couple. Um, welcoming. Everything was spot on. Beautiful Don't, pot of tea. Now I'm rubbish on names. I'm just giving an introduction to. Now, I'm you Richard are. and the wife. Hello, wife. Are you there behind us somewhere? Uh, Kirsty. Uh, tomorrow we'll be married a year. Third time lucky. We're, we're, we're all in the, the same club. Yeah. We're all in the yeah. same club. Yeah. Apart from Sandra, she's, never, she's only been married to me. Yeah. But, but yeah. those three, yeah. we're, 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 we're all, the threesome. And the best campsite ward in the oh, whole planet. Oh, 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 Neil, oh, 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 thumbs oh. up, mate. Oh, oh. oh well, listen, we better sing Happy Wedding Anniversary to <laughs> yeah, you. Yeah, that's happy it. Happy Wedding Anniversary. Is there a Wedding Anniversary song? I don't think there is, is there? We need Stevie Wonder to do I something, don't we? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Going to your head. Yeah. That's it, isn't it? Yeah. So, there, there isn't a wedding anniversary no, song. No, I don't think there is, though. No. Definitely not, no. There's like wedding bells, there's yeah. wedding songs. Yeah. I don't think there's got happy no. birthday songs. And no, we'll have to make one up. Yeah. yeah. We need it, we need a band. I've yeah. got an idea, I'm going to... Yeah, I'm, I'm going to form a band. I need, I need a band. I'm going to Google it. Right. <laughs> right, it's after work. Now, who would have ever believed, Lee? After work, you can go for a walk on the beach. But, so, the reason I bought Sandra and Lee here, this is our nearest dog friendly beach. But you were talking about possibly going bell ringing soon? Tomorrow. Tomorrow. Are you going bell ringing, Lee? Probably. Probably. Come with me, guys. Come, come, come with me. People, people, come, come with Before we go to the beach, let's go to the gardens. 
Now then, because Sandra, I know you like ringing bells and everything and everything like that, and you've got no idea how lucky you are to have me and how exciting you're going to be to where I'm going to take you to before we go to the beach. Are you looking, are you looking forward to it? Are you trying to hint that you found me a bell to ring? A bell? Um, a bell? Why, why, why would you find a bell in a park or in a beach? No idea. Um, what are we having for tea? Have we have fish and chips? On the seaside, on the seafloor. Not done that, have we? You, you don't like you like sausage though, don't you? Lee? Or a burger yeah. or something? Um, okay. Right. So there's a beautiful park here, Sandra. You're going to like this. And there was little ducks in the little duck pond and everything. You get excited, Sandra. Lee's, 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 none of you have spotted it yet. Right, can you guess what I found for Lee and for Sandra? Because I need to see these bell ringing skills. There you go, Lee. Who's going first? Go on, Sandra. Time. <laughs> There you go. Is that you ring your bells? It's not bells. Come on, Sandra, play a tune. <laughs> Lee, you weren't expecting <laughs> that, were you? You don't play tunes on tower bells. Oh, right. said it's a glock and spiel. Oh. There you go, the tune. Was that it? Can we play a tune that we can all recognise and sing along to? <laughs> right, we're all, we're all... What do you mean they're not tuned? They're not... Of course they're tuned. They sound tuned to me. They sound tuned to you, Lee. No idea. They're weird. They're just random. Well, there is a sign saying under fives only next to you, Sandra. Play your three blind mice then, but they're not tuned. Right, and so the other reason I thought I'd come here, if you ever come with Vicky, this is a friendly, abled, accessible little park. Should we have a little walk around it? You've not been here, Lee. So if it's raining, you've got a little shelter here and all you know, your walks and everything. So I won't film all of this because I was here a few weeks ago and um, did film it then. Although I think them chairs may be new. And what 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 are they call Sandra? Red red hot pokers. Red hot pokers. And there's red hot pokers. And the lavender look at all the bees. Loads of them. The Proper bumblebees. Look at them all. They love these, don't they? We've got some of these in our garden, haven't we? So Norfolk in the distance. I can't believe what I've just found, Sandra. Found I've got a, some... You found a lost soul, didn't you? I thought I was going to say that. How did you know what? I, just, <laughs> I found a lost soul. <laughs> oh, there's, there's a soul lost at sea. <laughs> Pinch, pinch my um, pinch my strap line on that one. Well and truly. <laughs> uh. As I'm recording this uh, today, what day? it's Monday after work, coming up on Thursday, the 80th D-Day celebrations, and there's beacon lighting um, near where we are at Waynefleet somewhere, and. There's a Skegness beacon, that might be being lit as well. There's one in Boston right by that. I took a picture at the time, the hotel, where I said with mum at the start of the year, if we got one there. So we've just, got, we've just walked along the beach, and we've just come to Skegness, 
see from where the lifeboat station is and the clock tower. I think fish, I think I think I'll I think we'll have fish and chips, Sandra. But I don't want a full bag of chips. You don't. No, I'm not a big chip eater. I am partial to a bit of ice cream though. There's lots of fish and chip shops. Sandra, a lot of places don't know, Skegness has actually got an outdoor Lido in the middle of Skeggy. Look, look, look. Your, your eyes lit up when you saw that, didn't they? Yeah, but it says pool and fitness suites, and I remember the club or something. I think you can get day, day tickets on it. Oh, we're contemplating on fish and chips or something, aren't we? Um, and battered fish and chips. We're just having a quick recce on a cafe, but we're on a mission for fish and chips and burger. Jumbo sausages. What are you having, Sandra? Haddock. Haddock and chips. And like haddock, chips, mushy peas, and curry sauce. And then we'll have a stroll back and eat them. Romantically, Sandra, you've got no idea how lucky you are to have me, Sandra. Have you? When was the last time we bought you fish and chips at the seaside? Hang on a minute. Have I ever bought you fish and chips at the seaside? Yeah, you have, but it's been a crazy few years to be fair. The last time I remember going to a chippy at the seaside was at a farm from we used to go to Shell Island. That's the last time I remember. You remember going to that chip shop by the car park? Do you remember Lee? Am I imagining it? Yeah, yeah this chip shop, funny enough, I think it's called the Angels. So we're just by the famous clock tower, Macadie's up there, KFC up there, the Embassy Theatre. We're going, I'm, I'm, I'm going to a show in August at the Embassy Theatre. Oh, and um, me and Lee are going to go on the open top bus from Skegness to Ingemels. Are you going to join us at some stage? One of them. And each bus, apparently, the open top buses, has a name. And if you ask the bus driver, you get a sticker and you can collect them all to say that you've been on all, 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 all the buses. Oh, it's just like being on holiday, isn't it? Yeah, but we're not on holiday. <laughs> I know, but we're not, we've never done the touristy thing here, have we? So I just thought. I don't know about you, but I'm still unpacking the same thing. So I don't even have to unpack my clothes. Uh, just, I've got the electricians here all day. <laughs> yeah, the electrician. Yeah. Oh, the electric work's all done. Just don't talk about the light bulbs. So. <laughs> There's a story. So go on, so, 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 let everybody know what, 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 no, what, what happened. Go on, what happened? No, it's me. It's fine. It's all good now. Putting light bulbs in a light bulb fitting. It's a good idea. It's a very good idea. <laughs> Oh, I'm impressed. Lee, open up, let's have a look. What have you got in there? Goodness me. Right. Oh, is that the curry sauce? So, I'm just meandering our way down by the boating lake. There's something I want to show Sandra and Lee down here, but they're not seen. I must have mentioned so many times that I am not a chip chip person, a chippy chip pers person. And I'm not just saying it. But these are probably the best chippy chips I've had in donkey's years. They're all fluffy in the middle and crispy on the outside. Oh, they're really good. They're seriously good. And the fish batter is just to die for. Absolutely amazing. Mmm. Have a chip goose. Oh. Oh, oh my. Oh, oh no. Whoa. Oh. Sandra, there's about 50 geese coming to join us. Oh. Oh, and pigeons and seagulls. It's a bit, oh, oh, well, these big things coming here. 
Play to the party, aren't they? Oh! Let's <laughs> go! Oh! Um. Right. Hello, fella. What are you doing? Well, at least they're not being aggressive, are they? Birds of a feather flock together. Right, well, that was a very unusual. Um, now, some very unusual visitors. What are you doing? Hello, duck. You know, Sandra, I'm not just saying it, but sometimes we have a spontaneous idea like that, like a chippy C. It works out the best. I absolutely love that. And fish and chips, it was really nice. Mushy peas. The curry, it was gorgeous. And then all the people that joined the party with us, all the geese and the ducks and pigeons and seagulls. And wonderful, absolutely wonderful. Let's get some duck food next time and come and feed the ducks. Right, I thought these were very, very pretty, Sandra. Come and, come, come, come and sit down next to me. You don't want to sit down as well, Lee. You're going to in on it. And Sandra's going to tell us all about these pretty flowers. I can't see your head. Are you, are you on here? What are they? They're very pretty, but I don't know. What do you mean you don't know? Lee, what are they? Flowers. Flowers. What are they? So I was guessing I'd say they might be related to poppy, maybe? But it's a guess. Oh. Looks like there's been a stuck sleeping there. Mm. So we don't know what they are? They're possibly related to Poppy, but as a guess. They're very pretty. Mm. Right, so shall we finish the video off here for today? I've got this old version, another mixed up one. I know what they are. Oh, oh, hang on a moment, hang on. Oh. That's called Echinops. Echinox? Equinox. 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 Equinops. Equinops. Yeah. <laughs> it's not a Sticky Willy. No. Right. Those look like thistles, them up there. No, it's more echinox. Oh, right. Did he flower? Oh, hang on yeah. a minute. There's, 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 a, there's, there's, there's a bee. There's a bee. There's purple flowers when they come out. Purple flowers. Okay. Well, isn't it a beautiful little walk somewhere that you may not have discovered unless I brought you here? Fish and chips for your tea? I'm sure I would have found it eventually. Yeah. Mm. Thank you, Andy. Possibly. I'm going to say goodbye. Goodbye. Thank you.